hi everyone so welcome back to dart programming course so let's get started with a building very simple hello world application so for that let's just start first intellij ide so you can go to your start menu and search for intellij and it will pop up with the intellij ide community edition okay so we are going to start with a very fresh first uh, new project creation so create a new project and there are a number of options are available for creating project like a java project or maven gradle groovy project kotlin so we are going to continue with the dart project so as uh, this course is all about uh, dart as a programming language and once you select the dart just put uh, dart sdk path so by default this part it will take but if you have installed this uh, dart sdk on some other part just browse from here and select the proper part this is the dartm part for the chrome.exe path and that is the uh, exact same as uh, where we have installed this dart sdk apart from that they have given some uh, sample code generation template so we are going to continue with the console based application apart from that there is a number of web apps related uh, templates also given so I'm going to continue with the console application so let me just select next and give the project name so let's give dart tutorial I'm going to continue on a F drive you can uh, select any location for your project location and select finish So it will pop up with uh, some of the tips. So I'm just going to close it for now. Okay. So it has created this new project Dart tutorial and inside the Dart tutorial, the number of folders are available. So you can see the library bin. Mostly we are going to make all those coding inside this bin folder and a library. So default, it has created one file like main dot dart along with that there is one yaml file also has been generated but i guess we do not need to worry much about those things so we'll focus on a programming part in this course okay so let me just close this part and let's create a simple hello world so by default it has a created this main function for us so this is like a, you can say the entry point to starting any program inside the uh, Dart programming language. So it has uh, already returned one simple hello print function and along with that it has called one function which has been defined inside this lib Dart tutorial. So uh, let's not call this function instead of that. Let me just put hello world simple. Okay. And it has imported this particular package uh, dart tutorial dart tutorial dot dart as a dart tutorial so it is a part of this uh, uh, dart tutorial you can say as like a library function it has been written uh, inside this dart tutorial so uh, we'll see all those function and uh, looping and all those main feature of this programming language uh, into next uh, or future videos so let's uh, for now let's see how to run this particular file so you can just select this particular part run main dot dart or the shortcut for running this is shift f10 so i'm just going to select this part and it will start running so it has given me the output like a hello while printing or you can just i uh, guess right click and run main dart okay so hello while okay so so far so good we have created one uh, dart project and we have created one console based application where we have just printed simple hello world with the help of this print function in a dart programming language and the first entry point execution will start from the main and it will accept this argument so list of string so those who are a java programmer they may be familiar with uh, such a kind of syntax so for those uh, it won't be very much uh, different in a dart programming language Okay, 
so that is all about the hello world from the next video we'll see more construct related to this dart programming language like a variable constant string and many more features so that's all about this video see you into next video